Hey Zadie, this is Super Zamaga Barbecue, and today I am back after a long weekend at the UK Championship Tournament. If you haven't seen it already, go check out the footage over at WWE Network, or just check out the footage across Twitter. Uh, it's insane. I pretty much am in every single match. I'm in the front row, left-hand side of you, you're walking down the ramp. I had an amazing time, and I got some pretty awesome videos which I'm going to put and splice into this upload which are insane. Uh, some of the views, some of the captures I got from the event were insane and I want to thank every single one of you who mentioned in the comment section, who mentioned me on Twitter, just incredible. I got a hell of a lot more views than I usually do over that weekend so anyone who is new and watched the channel whilst I was gone then thank you, much appreciated. But let's get right into it. Because I want to talk about that UK City before we head off into Team Road to Glory. And the reason I want to head off into Team Road to Glory is because we're on the verge of potentially losing the card. I mean, literally, we're, we are very far from finishing. So we're going to have to get into that very soon. But I wanted to talk to you about something I started a while ago that just has to happen. Now UK CT or UK Championship Tournament is out of the way. If you like what you see, make sure you remember to hit that like button as many times as freaking possible. That'd be amazing. Thank you. Now, if you haven't watched the tournament already, you need to go watch it. I was previously in the NXT TakeOver crowd in London. And that was really ridiculously high. This crowd was way, way smaller. But the noise and just the excitement. And it's the first time I've ever been ringside for a WWE event, so it was awesome. The shots I got, for example, getting Finn Balor to look me directly in the eyes again after his entrance. Then you have the clip of Neville doing the red arrow. He, where has he been on the mic all these years? I mean, that guy is so awesome. And just one second, one second. And talking of Neville, this is fucking amazing, right? This, signed by Neville, NXT Bell. I got it signed whilst I was at the event. We got VIP access whilst we were there to go to get a, it's a, basically eight items signed. I asked him very, 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 very kindly, could you please, please sign the belt? And he was more than happy to oblige. He's such a nice dude, but he was keeping his heel persona up. Don't you worry about that. He um, He's a bad dude now. He's a bad, bad dude. But yes, thank you, Neville, if you ever watch this video for what uh, uh, sign the belt. It's uh, honestly a great honor to have your name on here. Maybe I should go about getting the rest of the belt signed now uh, because that's incredible. On the subject to UKCT and Neville, oh, I've got this nice, awesome, I, I really, really like this uh, shirt. This, I think, was only for the uh, the UK Championship tournament, but this is the King of Cruiserweights. I hope they sell us in America because this, this is amazing. And also, I've uh, got this t shirt, which is actually exclusive, I think, to the Euro Shop in the UK. So I don't think you can actually get it anywhere else at the moment, but uh, hopefully you guys get access to it if you are in other parts of the world. Uh, but yes, Neville t-shirt and the UKC t-shirt as well as a signature. And got to meet Neville as well, which was awesome. Guys, I, I cannot tell you how excited I was to come back home and see the designs from a guy that I I commissioned this a while ago. And I'm saying this now, Dodo Supercard, this has to happen. It needs to happen. And what I mean by it needs and has to happen is you may or may not have seen um, that there's uh, been a couple of rumors about potential new tiers and stuff like that in Supercard. What perfect time then to introduce new cards into the game. And I'm talking about UK Championship Tournament cards. Now, believe it or not, I actually asked this person, if you haven't ever seen any, any of his designs before, Sasha for Life, who actually creates these amazing designs. And I mean, these are some of the best customs I have ever seen. And personally, I think these look so authentic. You put these in the game, they wouldn't go amiss. And I asked uh, this guy called Sasha for Life to create these cards a long, long time ago. And I just saw some just pop up in my, in my inbox. He said, I watched the event. You know what? I'm going to send a couple of extra ones across to you. And you've got the Finn Balor card. You've got then got the Neville card afterwards. Nigel McGuinness. Uh, Pete Dunn as well. Uh, Mark Andrews. Tyler Bate, the U UKCT champion. The first ever United Kingdom champion and Trent Seven who as far as I'm concerned just I love the mustache the mustache mountain movement is definitely 
in full swing and Wolfgang as well because he looked awesome. Dude, the dude's like the new Bam Bam Bigelow with the moves he's doing. He just sorry, who who has ever seen a guy that big do a Swanton bomb? I mean, wow. Um, those cards just pop up on the screen. I saw these amazing designs. I thought this has to happen, Supercard. Supercard Tech Note, now you all noticed that the stats are a little bit higher because, as I said in a previous video, money in the bank rewards for this month are Braun and Charlotte. Go and check that out because I talk about the possibility of a new tier, and these are what I think would be the stats on those new cards. And I suggested this a while ago for, I mean, we're talking when the UKCT Championship first became a thing. I just want to know what your feelings are. Do you think this these would suit the game? Do you like the designs? Do you think the designs are okay? Are they terrible? Are they are they worthy of a wave from Tyler? Tyler, give us a wave. Tyler, Tyler, give us a wave. That was amazing, by the way. If you've, I did. I did actually post up a video on Instagram and Twitter of the celebrations uh, and just being that close, uh, experiencing it. There's nothing that's going to remind you of the experience because you had the confetti falling down. And because there was, I'm, I'm telling you, there's a lot of alcohol there. There's alcohol across the entire floor and I think just sticking to people because you know, it was a hot arena because everyone was just going mental at the final match. I will say, by the way, a done a Tyler Bay has to go down as one of the matches of the year. No question about it. So yeah, I just wanted to share that experience with you guys and also to show those new cards. Um, you may or may not have heard this, this crazy rumor that um, Kurt Angle is going to be back in the WWE as soon as the Hall of Fame is done. And that obviously means that potentially he could be in WWE Supercard very very soon and I only have one suggestion for you if you want it to happen that is to hit up Dodo e Supercard wherever you can and ask that these cards or the UKCT people like Tyler Bates or Trent Seven or you know, Finn Balor you know just a special event card like this this kind of thing needs to happen more more event cards like this where you get the rights to people. I know it's hard because these guys are not specifically, I believe, contracted to WWE for merchandise stuff. And especially that Kurt Angle card has to happen because he's back finally. And uh, on that note, I'm going to leave you guys with the last uh, highlight of uh, me being at UKCT. I uh, hope you enjoyed this and I'm going to segue out. And go to the Road to Glory finale, a Team Road to Glory finale, so we can get ourselves that Samoa Joe, which is one of the best cards in the tier. And it kind of just goes towards my feeling that we are going to get a brand new tier soon, because they're just giving out all the great rewards. But it seems the team events, they are focusing on giving us the really, really good cards. So, uh, yeah, if you got yourself some decent cards in the Team Road to Glory, let me know in the comment section below. Where did your team get up to? Comment section below. And let's go across there now. Segway! Let's go, Jesus! Let's go, Jesus! Another one. Oh, dear. Here it comes. Another one. It's a troll of Gil. Hey, JB. I brought a new gun today. Do you want to hear it? <laughs> got it now. Is it done? Oh, I got the last 10 points. Oh, yeah. Samoa Joe, if you didn't know already, the best card in the tier with Seth Rollins. They've done this a lot over the last couple of weeks. I got the last 10 points. I'm pretty smug right now. Just to throw out to another uh, supercard creator. You might know that person. Maybe I'm forever smug. Who knows. Ah, but there is Joe. Joe is done. And we're joined by a wild person. Uh, da, 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 <laughs> really? <laughs> so we've got to get all the other awards. Now we've got to get Kevin Owens KO. Done. Um, not showing up as dominant the night before, or the, the Raw beforehand. So that's a good sign that he might stay champion. I hope he stays champion. Big E, in another stupid angle. There. Um, I, don't, I don't know the angle they got with Tyler's anyway. It's, it was funny that the first week, and maybe like kind of funny the second week, and then now it's like, really? 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 Right back! 
<laughs> why why right back? Why right why, back? Why back? No, why? No. Why? Why back? Um, you and Luge do another video, please. We've actually got a uh, collab. Uh, not me and Luge, but me and someone else have got a collab, which is coming out tomorrow, I hope. Um, and it's going to be awesome. It's going to be amazing. I also want to say a massive congratulations and thank you to Cable, who won the Twitch stream uh, subscriber giveaway. And basically, I'll explain what happens. If you subscribe to my Twitch channel, then you get automatic entry every single week into a giveaway. One name is pulled from the hat, and that person then gets pretty much every card in that uh, in that event. Obviously, not for Team RD, because that would be insane. Um, but if we have a look here, he Cable was like second. Only by like... 70 points? He ain't come first for once. But I'm... Hey! <laughs> That's what she said. <laughs> so, no, GD to him, he did really well. He set the standard pretty high. From the start, he was like on 500 odd points. Yeah. Um, Simon, Charlie as well, M. Harry, or Harry, Battle Ostrich, Gilly. <laughs> hey, I got the last points for Joe. That's all that matters. <sighs> and we all know why. Hmm. Because um, <laughs> I like the glory. Glorious. Glorious. There's Samoa Joe. Best image in the game as well. One of my favorite Samoa Joe images. One of my favorite images full stop. So, so happy I got this card finally. I'm still missing Seth Rollins to get the four best cards in the game, which are Rollins, Joe, Styles, and Brock. Maybe we'll see even more cards come available soon. Who knows? Uh, but that's it from me. Remember to like this video and subscribe to the channel using the link that's going to pop up just below me right here. Thoughts about UKCT, where your team finish and team Road to Glory, where you're expecting the Road to Glory cards to be, if you can let me know what they are as soon as it goes live tomorrow in at the comments section below. And that's it from me. Thank you so much for watching this and I will see you all soon. And also don't forget to check the description below for details to Twitch, Twitter, Instagram and one last thing and that's two. Give us a wave. Safe!